2016 High Point University baseball season begins this week with a home game against intertried rival UNCG on Friday, February 19th at 4 p.m. HBU went 29 and 26 last season. They finished fifth in the Big South with a 14 and 10 conference mark. The Panthers returned 19 letter winners with just four position starting players. Josh Green, the preseason Big South Player of the Year, will continue to spark the offense alongside junior shortstop Chris Clare, sophomore first baseman Carson Jackson, and sophomore second baseman Hunter Lee. You know, just practicing every day, getting a feel for things. You know, usually I've been, for the past two years, I was working with the same outfielders this year. You know, you got to get used to them and uh, just used to playing with them. But, you know, that's why we practice. So I think we got a good feel on how we're going to do things in the outfield. So I'm pretty excited about that. It's, it's nice, you know. We had two really solid years uh, up the middle and defensively. I know Cozart is very happy with our defense production and we like to call ourselves the uh, Purple Curtain. And it's basically just solid defense, you know. Um, this year, you know, we lost a lot of position players. We only have four returners that have played in the field. And, um, you know, it's nice to get the new guys in here. And me and Hunter Lee just showing them how, how we go about our business and just grinding every day. The pitching staff will be fronted by redshirt senior Scott Hoffman and junior Andre Scrub. Hoffman boasts being a two-time former MLB draft pick, while Andre Scrub has already been tabbed as one of the NCAA's top 100 college prospects. Um, it's great, you know, coming in my freshman year, I had a rough year, so I didn't really think I was going to be getting any accolades or even getting drafted. So, you know, now that the possibility of me getting drafted, it feels good to know that, uh, you know, the Cape Cod really helped me out and getting tabbed top 100. And it's, it's just a, a definitely a mark for uh, Coach Kozar and the work he puts in with his pitchers. The Panthers were picked fourth in the Big South preseason poll, but Coach Kozar has hopeful dreams that they will end up on top. I really like the way this club has come together. Uh, Chemistry-wise is one of the first things that we were looking forward to, and uh, these guys are very, very close-knit group. And so from an offensive standpoint, you know, we have a good core coming back. Uh, you speak first of Josh Green, who is uh, preseason conference player of the year, um, led us in virtually every offensive category last year. Um, so having him at the core of the offense really gives us somebody that we know uh, we can kind of look to for leadership. You know, I think a successful season for us would be to break through and win a conference championship. We haven't really talked about that very much as a team. Um, we talk about the process. We talk about controlling what we can control, and that's being prepared on a daily basis. Uh, we know what our strengths are. Our strengths are throwing strikes on the mound and playing tremendous defense. Uh, we've got great capabilities on the defensive side of things. Um, our infield play is special. Our outfielders can go and get it behind the plate. We can throw runners out. Um, but I think we're just going to compete really hard in every game. We're going to stay focused on what we do best, and the results will take care of themselves. We're not worried about results as much as we are uh, focused on the process. Come out Friday, February 19th at 4 p.m. to watch Scott Hoffman and the Panthers take the field. This is Cam Scott with the Panther Report.